Recently, someone asked me, Jimmy, what can I do to make sure that my loved one is safe and well taken care of in a nursing home or assisted living facility? And I guess the three most important things that I can think of are visit, visit, and visit. Visit at odd times, visit on a regular basis. You are going to be the best person to know if your loved one is safe and being taken care of like you want them to. Another good piece of advice is to get to know the staff. Get to know the names of the people who are taking care of your loved one. Also get to know their supervisors. If you see something, if you hear something, if you smell something that you don't think is right, don't hesitate to go to the supervisor of the floor or the wing where your loved one is. Every floor, every shift is going to have one person who's going to be the supervisor, whether it be the director of nursing, whether it be a registered nurse. Go to that person with any concerns that you might have. Another important point is to go to the care plan meetings. Generally, in a nursing home, every 90 days, there's going to be a meeting where the staff, the nutritionist, the social worker, the whole health care team at the nursing home gets together and talks about your loved one. It's important to go to these meetings to voice your concerns and to find out why things are being done so you know what's being done and you know and the staff knows the concerns that you have. The other thing you can do is if you're not getting satisfaction from going to the care plan meetings or speaking with the staff is to call us at Varner and Segura. I'm Jimmy Segura and I handle cases involving nursing homes and assisted living facilities. Thank you.